Welcome back, dear students. So today we will be discussing the next part of the chapter's amplifiers. We have already done three parts. Please check the playlist class 11 for part one, part two, part three of amplifiers. Okay, so in the last class we had seen single stage uh, CE amplifier. We had uh, done single stage CE amplifier or RC coupled RC. If, if you are saying RC, uh, then there has to be a resistance here. Therefore, it is known as RC, RL. Okay. So uh, we had seen the working. We had seen um, a certain gain equations. And we also saw the frequency response of RC coupled amplifier. Okay. So that was done in the previous class. Today, we are going to do a new topic regarding this, okay? Now, please understand that this is an amplifier. Amplifier ka kya matlab hota hai? What does an amplifier means? Mean that uh, an amplifier means that whatever signal, small signal we are putting, giving to the base, small signal, its amplitude is going to, its, its power is going to increase. So, this one, compared Compare this with this one, obviously the uh, amplitude has increased, right? So that means um, this amplification has been done, okay? So this is stage one. What if mujhe itna bada signal chahiye? What if I want this big signal? What if the, uh, the uh, number which I need, the voltage or the power or whatever, in whatever terms I'm measuring the signal, my um, my optimized or my needed signal strength is not this much. But amplification to ho hai. Signal ko bada kiya na isne kiya. But my required signal strength is not attained. So what should I do? Let us see. What, what we can do? Let us see. Now this um, uh, method of increasing step by step amplification. Matlab, I want this chota sa signal, itnu sa chota sa signal tha, usko yaha pe itna bada kar diya, right? Lekin mujhe kitna chita, what is my requirement? My requirement is this much. So can I add one more amplifier? Can I add one more? Plus one? Usse bhi nahi mila, to plus, phir se add kar sakti ho. So this stage, this amplifier can be repeated again and again. So that amplifier yaha pe signal thoda aur bada jayega. After repeating this, uh, this stage again, thoda sa aur bad jayega. If maybe I want to add, um, uh, add again, the stage is repeated again, then again the signal will increase, so and so forth. This method is known as cascading. Okay, it's known as cascading. Now in very simple terms, let us take an example. Ek aur bar mein clearly samjhati Okay, let us take an example. Now, for example, if you are, uh, there is a raste pe bahut bada patthar hai. It's a very big boulder, okay? A very big boulder is there on the road. Mm, your road is blocked because of it, okay? You are tying a rope to it and you are trying to pull it, okay? You are trying to pull it um, uh, with full force, but it's not moving. So what will you do next? If it's not moving, are you going to just leave it there? No. What will you do? You will call one of your friends, right? Your friend again starts pulling, but nothing is happening now also. It's not moving. We need more uh, strength, right? The output we need is not Even if you are two of them, it's, it's not happening. It's not moving. You're not getting the desired output. What will you do? You will call another friend, Okay. Three of you start pulling together. Then also you're not getting the desired output. What will you do next? You can call n number of friends to join you. Right? You can join. You can call n number of friends. So look at the stage and look at um, uh, the numbers. The first person is stage one. Right? Stage one. Jab ek hi banda tha ke liye, we did not get the output. Then stage two where his friend came and started pulling. We did not get the output. Stage three, where the third person came, started pulling. And till jitne bhi number, say for example, 10. So that means N number of people can come. So what is N? 
the last person over here is n right that means for example 10 10 people came for example so n is equal to 10 what will be the person in front of n that will be n minus 1 am i right that means if n is equal to 10, what will be the person standing in front? That will be 10 minus 1, that is 9. Okay, this process is known as cascading. That means, ek ke upar ek, ek ke upar ek, ek ke upar n. Kitne bhi mein stages join kar sakti hu to get the desired strength. Okay, same thing in electronics we have to do. I, uh, for the desired strength, if a uh, single stage amplifier se kaam nahi chalta hai, to main wohi stage ko repeat karungi, repeat karungi, repeat karungi, till I get the desired output. Okay, so this is cascading in electronic, in electronics language. Okay, same thing. Yeah, this is the, this is the first stage. Maybe I'm get the output of this stage is this much. Second stage, fir bhi a, a, a little more amplification I need, this much. Last stage, I'm getting this much. So this is my desired output. So to get the desired output, I may use how many ever stages I want. But in your syllabus, there are only two stages, uh, the first single stage, and then you have a multi-stage explanation, and then you have two stage amplifiers, okay? So till here, you have the, it's there in your portion. Fine. So this is cascading. And um, another important term which you need to uh, understand over here is this is stage one, right? This is stage one. And this is stage two. How are they joined together? Like in the previous case, when they were uh, pulling the rope, how, how are they connected together? How are the two uh, friends connected together? They are connected together by this rope. Right? They are connected together by this rope. Similarly, over here, how are they connected together? Are you putting something or directly through a wire or are you connecting it through a capacitor or are you connecting it through a transformer or are you connecting it through a resistor capacitor um, uh, combination or are you connecting it through an inductor uh, capacitor combination? Whatever this connection between two stages, that is known as coupling okay the processing of connecting two stages is known as coupling right fine so um, there are various types of coupling okay before we go on to that let us see the gain okay now gain in every stage for example iska first stage ka gain hai a1 what do you mean by gain output voltage upon input voltage okay so a1 ka gain hai v0 vo1 vi1 okay that will be the gain of a first stage what will be this gain of second stage again output voltage of stage 2 upon input voltage of stage 2 fine and so on so let us see what will be the final gain the total gain will be First stage ka gain multiplied by second stage ka gain multiplied by third stage ka gain so on so on so on and so forth last stage ka gain so if n is equal to five if you have five stages so a1 a2 a3 a4 a5 all multiplied together gain okay that will be the total gain fine so that was a, why do we need cascading when I already but the need of cascading need of cascading can be asked First, stay, uh, first point, need of cascading to obviously get the desired output. Number two, if there is distortion in any stage. Distortion means I'll use the previous example only. Agar ek banda chakra ke gir jata hai. Thikhe, ye banda chakra ke gir gaya. Can the others help the output? Yes, definitely. They are not going to, um, it's not going to go back to zero, right? They are still pulling. Others are still working, right? So even if there is distortion in any one, one stage that can be nullified in the other stages. Same thing is happening over here in, in other, uh, in the, this type of cascading also. If there is distortion in any stage that can be, uh, that can be utilized, that can be used or that can be nullified in all the other stages. Okay, fine. 
So uh, let us uh, see the need for cascading. So uh, when I say stage in the previous section also, when um, you know we saw the stages, a stage means single stage. See, amplifier is sta one stage. Okay, you are just going to repeat it in various stages. I will show you the picture also. See, this we learned in the in the previous uh, class. You know, this much section is done. What did I do? This is stage one. Okay. इसी को मैंने रेप्लिकेट किया यहाँ पे सेम थिंग इज हैपनिंग ओवर हियर सो दिस इज स्टेज टू अंडरस्टूड दिस इज सिंगल स्टेज एंड वो सिंगल स्टेज को ही अगर मैं डुप्लीकेट करती हूँ देन इट इज स्टेज टू एंड हाउ इज दिस कनेक्टेड सी ओवर हियर देर इज अ रेजिस्टर एंड अ कैपेसिटर एंड इट इज कनेक्टेड टू द बेस दैट मीन्स इट इज आर सी आर सी से कनेक्शन हुआ है कपलिंग हुआ है सो इट इज आर सी कपल्ड um rc coupled amplifier okay so let us see what is the need of cascading again like i said it is to increase extremely weak signals okay uh, next distortion i already told you distortion can be reduced in uh, by multiple stages and at present it uh, any electronic device can process digital or radio electrical signals Okay, so for processing such signals, we need a multi-stage amplifier. Okay, so uh, I hope you have understood the um, concept of multi-stage, single-stage amplifier. It's cascaded. That is known as multi-stage of multi-stage amplifiers. Okay, and how are they connected? That is known as um, coupling. Okay, over here you can see R and C is used to connect from one stage to output. This is its output, right? This stage is its output. So output is connected to the input. That means एक बंदा दूसरे बंदे का हाथ पकड़ रहा है, okay? So output is connected to input. So it's cascaded through resistance and capacitor. Therefore, it is RC coupled amplifier. Let us see the types of amp uh, uh, cascading or the types of uh, coupling used. Okay, types of cascading. Okay, so RC coupled. is one type where you will use resistance and capacitor to uh, you know connect one one type one stage to the other so if i had to draw it first stage okay input is given here this is stage 1 and while connecting i will use an r i will connect r use rc resistance and capacitor and then i will connect it to the second stage and here is your output okay second lc lc means that is inductor inductor and capacitor coupled transformer coupled that means in both between both the uh, stages it will be coupled through a transformer next direct coupled direct coupled means there is no body in between wo directly hath jod rahe hain dusre ka hath khud hi pakad rahe hain okay that is direct coupled now uh, due to covid uh, 25% of your syllabus has been reduced and this year though all this is there in your textbook uh, lc coupled is being deleted this year okay transformer coupled is deleted this year so you just have to uh, go through rc coupled and direct coupled okay rc coupled somewhat uh, the uh, what can be asked is rc coupled um, i mean multi stage rc coupled amplifier and its frequency response so please understand frequency response i have already done in the previous class fine so in the next class we will see rc coupled amplifier and direct coupled amplifier okay hope this is clear and uh, any doubts please feel free to ask Thank you and I have a, have a great day